ربان له للجمعة غير ثياب لبسه المرتفعة. He also had two special garments for Friday prayer, and I really want to emphasize this for the men. It really bothers me every time I go to Juma to see people wearing T-shirts, wearing jeans. Where I mean, in the United States you know, and, and England, I'm sure is the same. But it really bothers me personally because, you know, I I came out of the Christian tradition, and in Christianity, you had what was called your Sunday best. It was like the, your, you had a special suit or dress that you wore for, for going to uh, church. And the Prophet ﷺ had special Jum'ah clothes that he wore. He took a bath. He put on scent. Jum'ah should be a big day. It's not just you go to Jum'ah and you wear uh, your t-shirt with sometimes you even see them with designs and, and, and things on them or... Corolla or something like that. I mean, it's re it's really I find it just the the degradation, you know, human degradation of modern man with no understanding of who he is or who she is. That you're actually vicegerents of God on earth, and Juma at least give that day its due and wear nice clothes to Juma. The um, I just find it really disgraceful personally because I know Wallahi. If they went to do a job interview, they wouldn't dress like that. And, and that's what Juma is. You're, you're going, it's an interview with God, you know, to see whether you're acceptable or not. So if that's all you give God, then don't expect God to give you anything back. Wallahi, I am in the opinion of my servant of me. And if that's what you think about God, that you're going to wear your t-shirt and your jeans, to God's house on Friday, then, you know, it's just, it's very sad. And I, you know, I lived in Mauritania with Bedouin. Wallahi, never would any of those people go to the masjid. And they prayed five times a day in their uh, sirwal and their, they always put on their robe, always put on their robe to go to the masjid. Khudu zina tukum kulli masjid. Take your zina. You know, your ornaments to every masjid. That's what the Quran says. Khudu, fi'al amr. Take your zina to every masjid. So the Prophet ﷺ had special garments for Friday prayer that were not included among the precious clothes he regularly wore. So you should have a Friday clothes that, that you set aside and just wear them for Jummah. That's the sunnah. Take your bath, put on your perfume if you're for the men, and really go looking nice. And if people ask you at work why are you dressed up, then tell them, because this is our Sunday. This is the day that we go uh, in congregation to worship together.